body saw. When we get set up, we're gonna talk about elbow positioning first and then we'll kind of run through a bunch of the scaling that we can do. This is an anti-extension exercise, meaning that as our elbows or our hands get away from our body, there's gonna be increased demand that's placed on our trunk musculature and we're doing our best to not arch our back. So we're trying to stay in a straight line from our head to our sacrum or our, our hip, essentially. So if I'm here, starting from my knees would be the easiest position. Elbows are gonna be directly under shoulders. And then you want the, the foam roller to kind of be at your wrist start. Elbows come forward, coming back to that starting position. Chest pressed away, abs on, straight line from my head to my tailbone. So from there, if I wanna make it a little bit harder, I will go onto my feet. Good. And then the next progression from there would be a one leg body saw. And then further progressions is gonna be where your foam roller is set up relative to your torso. So if I get my elbows under me, when I roll out, I'm not getting as far with the sawing motion. But if I get my elbows out in front of me to start and the foam roller out in front of me, as I roll out, that's getting further out in front of me, which is increasing the load placed on my trunk stabilizers. So as always, we're looking for quality over quantity or try a couple of the progressions. And if your form starts to compromise, then you need to regress back to the, the, the version that you can do with the, um, with the um, best technique.